This is WPLT News at 6. Good evening. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Brittany Tarwater. I'm Ted Hall. Glad you're with us here for WPLT News at 6 o'clock. An 11 year old boy and his six year old sister are recovering at UT Medical Center after a crash in East Knoxville. Their grandfather died in that crash on Tuesday. The family, though, says they are thankful for the support from the community, but also to a total stranger who stepped in to help. Here's a look at new video from that Good Samaritan we got today. Just moments before the crash, the two cars racing by his motorcycle. He tells us he heard and saw the whole thing. He immediately turned around, started performing CPR on the little girl. Our Sam Luther spoke with the man about these tense moments. As two Dodge Chargers zoom by, Davy Spurgeon captures the moments on his helmet camera. And all I hear is the loudest sound I think I've ever heard in my life. Instead of driving by, he stopped and turned around. There he'd find 11-year-old Gage and his 6-year-old sister Hadley, who were badly injured. He saw people standing around Hadley and stepped in and started performing CPR. And I just kept saying, we're not doing this today. I kept telling him, we're not doing this today. You're, 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 you're going to be good. You're going to be okay. And I just kept telling her that. And for a moment, she looked up, looked at me, almost as to like say, Let, let's do this together. And she just started fighting. Spurgeon stayed with Hadley until first responders arrived. At UT Medical, she's now recovering from a broken neck, arm, pelvis, and jaw, while her brother has a broken pelvis and damaged lungs. And it's horrible because you feel helpless. With his CPR training, Spurgeon felt confident in what to do. He said there was never hesitation on whether or not to turn around and help and encourages others in a similar position to do the same. And even if you don't know what to do, stop. You never know. You never know. You, you could be responsible for keeping somebody alive or at least being with them in their last moment. Like that means more than you think. In Knoxville, Sam Luther, WVLT News. It was the children's grandfather who was killed, Michael Williams. Two people have been charged with felony reckless endangerment and drag racing. There's a GoFundMe for the family to help pay for funeral costs and these medical expenses. Gage and Hadley, as you heard, both seriously injured with many broken bones. Still in the hospital and facing a long road to recovery. If you want to help them out somehow, we've got a link for you in the WVLT News app.